Hello everyone, welcome back to Nino Kuni 2 Revenant Kingdom. So, last episode I was about to take the plunge even deeper into the abyss. I'm gonna face whatever the hell that thing is. Only six battle points, alright. No! Her Majesty is fine. If the Queen of England is anything to go by, she is essentially immortal. Ah, oh, god damn it. I hate that thing so much. Of course. Jesus Christ. I need your help. Money puddle of goo. Not approaching that. Oh, never mind, it's offline. What are you doing, man? Whoa, 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 whoa. That is too much damage. Of course, I don't have anything to heal. Oh, thank you, Lofty. I'm getting the hell out of here. Yeah, I think this is the highest level. Damn it. Thank you, Lofty. Again. Seriously? So close. Just so close. Oh. Alright, good job, Leander. Spell. Please let it be the last one. I know it's not. Not even close. I'd forgotten how deep this place was. But then again, you know, it, it is the literal abyss. And the Kingmaker is at the bottom of the abyss. The bottom of the ocean. Oh, yeah, see, so Batu agrees with me. It's deep, dark, and wet. Alright, that should be the last one, yeah? Yes. And there's a waystone there where I can heal, thankfully. Oh no, that was not a way. Wow. No, that is a waystone, yes. I'm okay with it not saving. Or, actually, come to think of it, I should probably save. Alright, this one is gonna be the last one. Let me see. Tactic Tweaker. 
So that thing is definitely some kind of uh, dragonfish, right? Now here... Hmm. This is 11, this is 10. Right, let's go. Deeper still. <gasps> Dolorin, or whatever your name is. Oh, Evil Aura. Should've known. Because it wasn't Leander, obviously. Because that guy would never allow himself to be stepped on. So someone else was doing something to the queen. Apparently he was just poisoning Your her Majesty, directly. It is I, Leander! It is I, Leander! Please! You must come to your senses! Oh my god, the, the dialogue it is so too cringy. Late for that, I'm afraid. Your queen is gone. Henceforth she shall be my puppet. Nothing more. Well, dialogue was never the, the these games' strong suit, You will so. return her to me now! Mm, tell me, why do you even care? Her people think little of her. She is powerless, weak, unloved. Hydropolis would be nothing without its queen. And why is that? Even were I inclined to tell you, you would not understand. Yeah, I don't understand either. <laughs> the kingdom so it. is its people. Then I word. would ask that you do as your queen did, and surrender your feeble spirit to me. I surrender to none but her majesty! Yeah, I saw that. She literally stepped on you. Leander? She used you like a footstool. Is she coming around? <sighs> this has gone on long enough. Oh, he took the king's bond, you know what that means. Your realm breaker. Is doomed. Is realm breaker, realm destroyer, kingdom lasts. breaker. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that thing is ugly. Brain skimmer. Then the king's bond truly is broken. Indeed. You heard the man, no king's bond! Meaning we've got ourselves a kingmaker to club at! Indeed, Lofty. Hey, Lofty, you wanna, um, I don't know, row? You know, just do something? Shit. Brian Skimmer. Wavebreaker Kingmaker. How about you dogs? 42! Christ! I mean, we have ranged attacks. Well, that obviously did not go as planned. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fire Higgledies. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, that was my bad. I should have dodged into the beam so as to avoid it. Fire, Higgledies! Heal, Higgledies! Oh, God damn it! I am seriously just a, a klutz. Fi okay, I was gonna say fire higgledies, but yeah. Use what? Are you serious? Oh. Wow, that actually sucks. Yeah. 
How, how is he already there? Well, I guess he does know the uh, Kingmaker better than anyone. Time makers. All together now. Go, Lonnie Gagget. All right, time makers, do your stuff. That should be enough, right? You go now. Will this also cancel water attacks? Oh no! Smash the ice barrier. How do I? Oh! Just aim and shoot. They gotta be running, running low on water, right? Oh, that's the... The actual amount of water that I have left. Interesting. God damn it. There. Ran out just at the right time. Oh, wait, what? Christ. Hello, Brian Skimmer. Yeah, you think I'm afraid of you, Brian Skimmer? I'm not. You're annoying, but... Yeah, I have so many hours on... Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn that even without the aim assist, I could do this. Buy to your ice barrier, Brian Skimmer. Goodbye. I really need to level up considerably. Damn it, out of water. Use it! Quick! Use what? <laughs> what did he throw? Also, why can't I move the camera after unlocking? Not unlocking, I'm moving the lock on. Ground that bastard. Think vehicle these. Seriously, frozen. Hmm, I don't want to waste an all be gone on this. Oh, there we go. Remove that ice barrier. Why can't I aim up? Okay, now I can't. That was weird. Come on, 
Yes. Where? Damn it. Dude, just let me aim. I hate it when, when games do that. Never take away control from a player. Because they do know what they want better than you. And also because it just creates uh, oh, this, <clears throat> um, unpredictable behavior on behalf of the game. Because I'll I never know if the game is actually going to aim where I'm aiming, or if it's going to try to quote unquote correct my aim in some way. Maybe there's a, a setting to disable aim assist. But if there is, I didn't see it. I'll have to double check. Take all these, create a black hole, and now destroy that thing. Great. That black hole attack is one of the most powerful that Higgins have. Damn it. Hey, Lofty. I don't mean to sound impatient or anything, but help. I am impatient, I just don't want to sound impatient. I just want to be clear on that. Leander, don't freeze yourself. What is all mine? I guess that was for Leander. Yep, definitely for Leander. Wait, grab this. Also for Leander. Damn it. I was trying to dodge those spikes. I failed. How did you miss every icicle? God, you're just useless, aren't you? Ah, whatever. That works. And Evan Almighty loses out on experience, I think. I'm not actually sure if they, they don't get experience because they're unconscious. <gasps> Seriously? <laughs> sure thing, Dalaran. Hey. Of course. Uh -huh. <clears throat> you 
Yes, please do tell me the truth. I'm a big fan of truth. What? Oh, I remember now, yeah. She turns back time. I'll say that again. She has the power to control time. Yeah, the kings here are just gods. Straight up. I mean, even the time travel spell from uh, the first Nino Kuni game can only be used once in a lifetime. Hmm. And that explains why they're not worried about conserving the population. How? <gasps> I mean, he is a wizard. <clears throat> yes. Hmm. Yes. Uh huh? The ether? Of course. Let me guess. They're about to get married. Yep. One day, Leander. One day, we will marry. And you will be my king. We will rule together. Promise me. I promise. Uh, of course. I promise that I will marry you. That I will always protect you. I mean, the relationship didn't really change. Side. This is basically the same thing that was happening during the intro sequence, except she was stepping on him. Do you swear Which some guys are into. On your life? Personally, I, I do, don't like it. I do. But he wasn't oh, into it. I love you. At least I don't think he was. How could I forget? It is my most cherished memory. And the reason <clears throat> I gave my life to you in service. Your most cherished memory from a thousand years ago. I asked that you become my husband. My king. But the law of Hydropolis forbids it. I could not become king. I cannot. She's the queen. She can literally rewrite the law. Do not pretend, Leander. You know. You know better than any man of this realm. Whosoever possesses the ether possesses the right to rule. Really? It was the first king of Hydropolis who brought it back with him, and with it claimed his crown. But surely one such as I cannot... Who better? Who else has guarded this realm more vigilantly? Uh, you? Literally violating the laws of time and space? Care for it more faithfully. <clears throat> Again, you? As queen, I can accept no other. You must marry me. I command you. That's also a solution, just command but him to marry Majesty, you. I cannot. Why? For the sake of the kingdom? Yes. The hallowed realm over which we have watched for so long? Yes. If we are joined in marriage, then all must end. Time cannot repeat itself. Hydropolis must fade. I mean, that's not technically true, you just need to not procreate. Yes. And I cannot allow that to happen. Let go, Leander. This realm may fade, but another will soon blossom in its place. New life. A new kingdom. Can't you just all evacuate? It should have happened long ago. But I could not let it. I had to have one last day by your side. Again and again. Your Majesty. So this is Hydropolis' last day. But it is time at last. I am ready, Leander. The wheel must turn again for Hydropolis. The wheel of time. And if it brings our destruction, then so be it. It also brings truth. Truth Your is important. Is made up, then? <clears throat> I mean, she already gave you an order, it dude. Is. So come. 
take your place by my side. Be my husband. My king. I mean, there is only one seat on the throne. I will. But sure, give it a, give it a shot, I guess. Lepre these travelers have need of your aid. Go with them. Sorry, I didn't Forget realize the that that would have. Kingdom for a time. Uh, that voice line would be fully truly spoken. So. Truly. Thank you, Your Majesty. All right, that's a permanent join. Thank you. Um, I don't understand why <clears throat> there are these interruptions. I don't think there's anything that I can do that would change this. Let our that's a nice staff. For the sake of the world. Let the banners of war ne'er again be unfurled. United we stand as one single land. Okay, that's land number two. Or three, technically, since there's also the Kingdom of Nevermore. Just two two realms remain. The pact is sealed. Our nations stand together. And now I must bid you farewell. Pray. Oh, will. sorry. That was a misplay. That is, assuming you're still happy to join us, Leander. Of course. I only hope that I may be of use. I'm sure you will be. Aw, Lofty is so happy. Evan had freed Queen Nerea from Dolorin's wicked clutches. And for his troubles, he had succeeded in adding another nation to his burgeoning union. Burgeoning. With it came a great asset, Leander, whose wisdom would surely prove vital in Evermore's continued development. Oh right, he's, a, uh, he's good for spell work. <clears throat> I'm guessing he's the one who designed the the time travel spell or time reset spell a country where love is forbidden how strange yes very yes but i learned something there i learned how fiercely a leader can long to protect their nation and how much they can sacrifice for it she sacrificed nothing the queen was prepared to devote her whole life to her kingdom and for no one ever to know I mean, that, that's the purpose of a king. I'm not sure he understands I'm what a king I does. Met her. And Leander. Or that's what a king is supposed to be. Well, there's still a way to go. There's <clears throat> still an awful lot to learn. Yes, I know. I've really only just begun. In order to grow, we must first realize how small we are. <laughs> it's going to be fun watching you grow into your older, wiser self. Huh? What do you mean? I think it's pretty clear that the boy is from the future. You're too busy building your kingdom to notice anything else, aren't you? All right. I'll see you soon, Evan. Uh, yes. See you soon. All right. Well, <clears throat> that is it for today. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you again next time.